Hello everyone, welcome to Sheldon School. My name is James and this is Annabelle. We are both Year 11 students and have been selected for the roles of Head Boy and Head Girl for the current academic year. We hope you will have already seen the virtual tour which is on our website, but if you haven't, we would highly recommend it as it gives you an overview of the school site. You will also find a video made for our new Year 7s to ease them into life at Sheldon during these uncertain times. This may be of interest to you as it gives an idea of our pastoral system here at Sheldon, which is something that we are very proud of. Sheldon has a unique sense of community where student-teacher relationships provide exemplary support and teaching across all subject areas. We are very lucky to have such a great team of staff who work to help students achieve their full potential. But now, to introduce you to our subject areas at Sheldon. We now invite you to meet our faculty heads. The Business, Economics and Computing faculty was formed in 2003. We deliver computing and digital literacy at Key Stage 3, Business, ICT and Computing at GCSE and at A-Level Business, Economics and Computing. Results across all areas are strong and a record number of students are choosing our courses. Computing is a growing area of our curriculum and we're fortunate to have staff with specialisms in this area. I believe that a key role of the faculty is preparing students for life after school, whether that be in work or education. Our courses give valuable real-world experience, as well as qualifications that will aid progression to higher education. In all lessons, we aim to develop students' independent learning skills. We want them to be creative thinkers and to develop the autonomy that we know they will need in the world of work. We operate several links with industry. Our partnership with Lloyds Banking Group, for example, provides students with outstanding opportunity to experience the world of work. I study computer science at A-level and I chose it because I did it in, in GCSE and I think it's a really important subject for sort of modern society since we use technology everywhere and you're going to really, really struggle to find an industry that doesn't use technology and especially computers in some form. One of the features about Sheldon School is its focus on a wide curriculum and design and technology is an area about which we are extremely proud. We run a comprehensive range of primary workshops and we also hold the National Design Mark for the quality of our curriculum. All Key Stage 3 pupils do design and technology, with approximately 60% taking design and technology or food preparation and nutrition at GCSE. We also run A-levels in product design and fashion and textiles with a post-16 course in food science and nutrition. Our environment is fantastic with a purpose-built facility and our aim is to provide our pupils with an important range of life skills as well as a foundation for a career in design. DT includes food, textiles, RM and graphic products and the facilities are great. I'm doing a, for my major project, I'm making an architectural model of my grandparents' garage and making it more environmentally friendly. For mine, I'm doing a board game about sport to encourage more people to play. You can take product design at A-level at Sheldon. I'm planning on going to university and having a career in design. In Year 7, you get to spend dedicated English lesson time in the library once every fortnight. Our English teachers really value you reading and we're committed to making it enjoyable and making you feel really confident about it. In your lessons, we read a wide variety of different sorts of texts where you will meet memorable characters, have adventures in other worlds, take a trip to the Arctic and journey back in time to the worlds of William Shakespeare. I really enjoyed learning English in Year 7, especially reading the book Trash. I enjoyed learning about characters living in other countries and the, and the poverty. We want you to be able to express yourself and your ideas in a variety of ways and challenge you to write creatively and ambitiously. We teach you in your tutor groups in Year 7 to help build your confidence and to give you experience of working and communicating confidently with others. Overall, we believe our curriculum is really varied and engaging, designed to stretch your ability and your imagination. I hope to be meeting many of you and finding out about the books that you like best very soon. 
Welcome to Humanities, where we help you to really see your world, past, present and future. In Year 7 to 9, History and Geography take you on a journey through time and space, from the craze of the witch hunts to 20th century dictators, the earthquakes shaking below our feet, to the part you can play in protecting our planet. Trips to Cheddar, Big Pit and the battlefields help you think about what path to follow next. In Year 10, you start two-year courses that will dive into topics in more depth, whilst giving you the opportunity to immerse yourself in the experience through our visits to Berlin, Bristol and Swanage. Sixth form opens up some other subjects in our faculty, with the addition of criminology, psychology, politics and sociology. As you move through key stages three and four, you will be finding topics that spark something in you, and the breadth of subjects at Key Stage 5 gives you the opportunity to explore them in more detail. University experiences, lecture days and guest speakers help develop understanding of many of our subjects. We love being part of this faculty and really look forward to welcoming you to Team Hums. My favourite subject is definitely history because um, you get to learn a lot of interesting facts and about interesting people who've lived in the past. Um, and you get to like understand what it was like to live back in those times. Hello, bonjour, hola. In the Languages Faculty at Sheldon, you will build on your communication skills and gain an awareness of other cultures, their similarities and their differences. Throughout Key Stage 3, you will be immersed in French and German, and our experienced team are excited to pass on our love of languages and the countries where they're spoken. You'll be able to talk about things that have happened, and your plans for the future, as well as expressing your opinion and debating your point of view in the language. Many students have participated in exchanges and visits to France and Germany, making long-lasting memories and friends for life. Lots more have welcomed visitors from around the world. We want you to become confident communicators, and so we offer leadership opportunities, such as the Language Ambassador Programme. As a language ambassador, we went to different primary schools and watched their French plays. We gave them feedback on their speaking and pronunciation of French. It was very exciting because I enjoyed teaching them some French and helping them improve. By this stage, building blocks are in place for GCSE and additional language learning. Therefore, we also offer Spanish at Key Stage 4 and all languages in the sixth form. Learning a language opens doors, not only for your future career, but also travel around the world. At Sheldon, we don't set limits. The Learning Support Faculty and Hearing Impaired Resource Base at Sheldon aims to provide support for students with all kinds of difficulties. Our highly qualified teachers and teaching assistants can support staff and groups of students in mainstream lessons, provide individual programmes and class interventions to help with a range of difficulties including literacy, numeracy and social skills. Inclusion is a core value at Sheldon School. Hi, I'm Mr Avery and I'm the head of the Maths Faculty. We have 16 Maths teachers and we like to think that we are a knowledgeable and approachable faculty. When pupils join the school in Year 7, we very much follow on from the Maths study at primary school and gradually the Maths becomes more involved and ties in with work in other subjects. We try hard to make the subject as interesting and enjoyable as possible. All pupils study Maths in the GCSE and many then go on to study the subject here in the sixth form. Maths is incredibly important in modern society and as pupils at Sheldon we are equipped with the education and knowledge to succeed in careers and industries where it is applied. Our teachers are hardworking and passionate about their subject and this in turn inspires and encourages us to learn. While studying maths here you will get to go on trips to places such as Bletchley Park where you will learn about the code-breaking mathematicians of World War II and you will get to take part in mathematical challenges where you will work on a range of intriguing problems or while competing at a national level. Here at Sheldon we are very proud of our performing and expressive arts provision. The faculty has a dedicated team of 11 specialist teachers who work collaboratively to provide a huge range of opportunities in dance, drama, art and music, all of which are taught in superb facilities, including our state-of-the-art dance studio. We know that high quality arts education helps our pupils to develop confidence, creativity and excellent communication and interpersonal skills. 
At Key Stage 3, pupils receive lessons in all four subjects. We run annual arts days for your eight and year nine pupils, involving practitioners, artists, dancers, musicians and actors coming in to work with our students. We offer a wide range of GCSE courses across all four areas. At A level, we also offer music tech, photography and art textiles, in addition to dance, drama, music and fine art. One thing I love about the music at Sheldon is that it feels really inclusive for people of all abilities and ages. One thing I've loved in particular is having the opportunity to perform at the Young Musician of the Year competition where I was able to perform in front of a professional adjudicator. As a faculty, we put on at least seven or eight different performance events a year, including our major school production at Christmas. We also offer trips to galleries, theatres, trips abroad, extracurricular clubs, in-house art exhibitions, GCSE and A-level evenings. We also have numerous music ensembles, choirs and a large thriving orchestra. We feel that this creates a rich and vibrant arts experience for our pupils. I'm incredibly privileged to be part of the PSRE faculty here at Sheldon and it's a pleasure to watch young people's minds grow and develop. Life begins, and whilst we all may have different views as to when this happens, I think we can all agree that it does happen. Once it's started, our journey of life continues, and I believe that PSRE helps enhance this journey. It is an integral part of every child's education and ultimately life. Life's journey is becoming more complex, and it's our intention to help and assist young people to find their way, making sensible, intelligent and aspirational decisions. But what exactly is PSRE? PSRE stands for Personal, Social and Religious Education and so encompasses a number of areas, including careers, relationships, religious education and vocational studies. A real strength of our subject here in Sheldon is that it's delivered by a subject specialists, a dedicated team of people who are truly passionate about young people and the issues they will face as they continue on their journey of life. Our faculty is housed in dedicated classrooms and we're very fortunate to also have our new careers hub where one-to-one -one careers interviews take place alongside work experience. We believe our subject empowers young people to develop an understanding and empathy for others. Our philosophy in PE is to infuse and inspire all students to take part in regular physical activity. We have fantastic facilities here at Sheldon, including our sports hall, our gymnasium, astroturf, netball and tennis courts, and large playing fields. Each year, pupils take part in over 12 different sports. These include traditional sports, for example, rugby, football, netball, hockey, and gymnastics, right through to outdoor and adventurous activities, such as climbing, kayaking, and cycling. We are incredibly proud of our extracurricular programme here at Sheldon. We offer daily, after school and lunchtime clubs. Our aim is to maintain excellent participation rates alongside having competitive teams represented in school fixtures and tournaments. We regularly make county and regional finals in many sports. We offer a range of examination courses in PE at both Key Stage 4 and Key Stage 5, allowing our students to access sports courses at university and enter into a wide range of careers in sport. As soon as you start in Year 7, there are so many opportunities, especially with the sporting side of school. You can join so many different clubs, such as netball, hockey and rounders, and for the boys there's football and rugby, and there are always so many fixtures, fixtures going on with other schools. Um, it's a really good opportunity, you get to make so many friends with people you might not necessarily be in the classes with, but you make them through the clubs. Hi, welcome to Science. I'm Darren Granger, Head of the Science Faculty. We teach all three sciences at Key Stage 3, and both separate and trilogy science at GCSE, which we start in Year 9. In sixth form, you could study applied science, biology, chemistry, health and social care, and physics. We're very proud of our classroom, resources and staff, and we make great use of technology to enhance the practical work our students do. We offer an exciting range of extracurricular activities, including Key Stage 3 Science Club, Dissection Club, Lego Robotics and Reptile Club. Our aim is to develop enthusiastic and scientifically literate students who enjoy their time in science through fun and engaging lessons.